All right, guys, this is this is the video we obviously have all been waiting for. Teen steals prom shoes from Bestie. That is a mortal sin, of course, because girls and shoes, and we already know that. So let's get this going. Wow, are those the new Louboutins? Are those the new Louboutins? Oh, yeah, they are. Yeah, I told my mom, please go. Oh, wow, are you kidding me? You told your mom not to? Are you kidding me, Becca? You told your mom not to buy you those shoes? I'm stealing them, man, because clearly you do not want them, you piece of shit. Are those the new Lubidins? Lubidins? Whoa, those Labibudus. Like Alright, alright, shut up. Alright, let's see. What are they actually? What brand is that? I can't read it. Uh, no. I'd appreciate like two if my parents have gotten me a big house in the Louboutins. True, man. That's true. That is very true. Wow, Candace. You know what's so ridiculous? You guys are gonna... A lot of times, um, people... Like people when they steal things and stuff like that, um, it actually has less to. It doesn't necessarily have to do with them being poor, as much as it has to do with them feeling poor. I know it sounds weird. Like a lot of times, people will compare. So if you compare yourself, and this is why it happens more and more today. But if you compare yourself to other people, like and the other people are doing really well, you're going to be like, well, by association, I'm not doing particularly well. It's something that we don't think about. Now, I'm not trying to diminish because we do have class issues, yada, yada. And I think we need to, you know, obviously come up with a solution. To that. I'm just saying it's very interesting stuff. The, the, the reason I'm saying this is try not to compare yourself to the success of others. Try to just become the best version of yourself. Your parents' new house is so amazing. Whoa. Thanks, Olivia. It's not that great. But it has literal piss yellow walls. I miss being so close to you and all our school friends. Yo. The drive here sucks. I'd be happy here. You're so lucky. I, lo I love pee all over my walls lives up in the hills. Yeah. I hate yeah. my apartment. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. What's mine is yours, and Ooh. you can come visit me anytime. Very Thanks, Candice. Sexy. You're so sweet all the Candace. time. Candice. like my dad says, happiness comes Candy's nuts in your mouth, right? That was a meme for a while. Well, then, I just choose to appreciate life. Yeah. I'd appreciate life. It's easier to appreciate life when you're fucking rich, so shut up. If I lived here with a pool. Yeah, true. You're so funny, Olivia. Yeah, Olivia. So, what have you picked out for prom? Are we still going together? Of course. Do you want a match? Yeah, that's why I want to see what you have. Okay, let's see what you got. Oh my god, Candace. Oh my goodness. That's stunning. That's not and then bad. Those I guess. are shoes. How did you see the shoes? How did, how did she was blocking them? Whatever. I don't care. Wow, are those the new Louboutins? Are those the new Louboutins? Is that how you spell Louis Badan? I feel like Badan. That sounds like it's not. $3,000 yeah, shoes. Mom, wow. Are you kidding me? I, I, I sunk up. I went, oh, wow, at the same time, but no audio. You told your mom not. I have a pair of $60 New Balance from 2011. That's what I wear. As well as a pair of Nautilus steel toed shoes that my company, that my, my work <laughs> reimbursed me for. That's what I wear. I make good, I make good money. I could, I, and I, I wear fucking old clothes. This shirt, Walmart t shirt that my wife died for me. I don't give a fuck about status symbols, dude. I really do not give a shit. This is how you, I'm not even memeing here. Fucking live a humble ass life, motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Live a humble life, okay? Two? My mom's making me wear her old prom shoes from back in the day. Ew, hey. mom. Fuck you, bitch. Hey, they sound antique. If you think so. Do you just have your shoes picked, or are just picked already? Um, so far, just my mom's old shoes. My mom's old gachi shoes. Ew, gachi? Yuck. You know. Nice. But nice. I don't know how I'm gonna match that dress. I'm sure um, we'll think of something. Hey, I need to run to the restroom. Okay. I usually just call it my bathroom. I feel like I would call a restroom, like a public bathroom is a restroom. I don't call my own house, my own house's bathroom a restroom, but maybe I'm just nitpicking. But that's what we do on this channel. I have to I nitpick most of the time. Oh, shit. Smiling. Oh, my God. You know what's crazy is that she's wearing ripped jeans and people pay more for ripped jeans than non-ripped jeans. Get a life. Wow. Conveniently has an empty backpack to steal these Louboutins shoes. Uh, I'd appreciate like two. My parents have gotten me a big house in the Louboutins. Louboutins. Whoa. 
I'm out of here, bro. Wow. So, like, she went to the bathroom. Let's say she took, let's probably to piss. But then she maybe she took a diarrhea. I don't know. You left without saying a word. And she didn't figure this out yet. Like, I feel like you wouldn't even be able to get down the road without her fucking going like, what the fuck? You stole my Lubidins. You know what I mean? Like, what the hell's happening? It, this is prom night. How, who does she think took the shoes? Ow. Ew. Ew, you ugly, nasty animal. I'm just kidding. Pimples are, are just is what it is. Why do I feel so lousy? I got the shoes I always wanted. Yeah. Okay, this is prom night, so it's at least a day later. Probably a week. They probably established it. They probably didn't establish it. I don't know. Now, her phone's ringing, but it's not even on. So this is, this right now, this woman's going through a paranormal crisis. Hey, Candace. Olivia, I lost my shoes. Olivia, I lost my shoes conveniently the second that you left my house while I was in the bathroom. I don't know how this could have happened. How did these things happen together? Oh my God, what do you mean? The ones my mom got me? The ones I showed you. Oh yeah, the Louis Vuitton. Yeah, I can't find them anywhere. She's gonna be furious to know I lost them. Yeah. Maybe the maid took it. You think so? They have a maid for that house? What are you talking about? That house is fucking, it's okay. It's a nice house, I guess. It's, but it's not like maid worthy. <laughs> I don't know. Ruby's been with us for so many years. She's like family. What, did she move to the new house with you? Okay, interesting. What are you gonna do? Are you gonna file a police report? For missing shoes? Hmm, I don't know. What the fuck is her phone case? Holy shit, that's over the top. Oh, I think I just might not go to prom today. Yeah, what? Why not? Decision. <laughs> I was thinking about it, and I'm in love with Marcus. So, so even if we chill at home and watch TV... Who the fuck is Marcus? We'll have a great time. But you were supposed to be my ride. Whoa. Oh, I know, Olivia. I'll still take you. I'll still have my chauffeur I go over there, pick you up and drop you off at the doodle dop. You know, like, what the fuck? Why? What the hell's happening here? You know, on second thought, I can ask my mom to take me. So, like, right now, she's realizing in this scene that she stole these shoes that she'll have to potentially be in front of her friend with. So she's like, oh, shit, a good thing this bitch ain't going. Mommy, I'm going to need you to take me. I got these brand new LeBron's. Are you sure? Yeah, Candace, it doesn't make sense for you to drive all the way here and drop me off. You live so far away. Yeah. It's okay, I don't mind. Wait a minute, is there a scuff on the Lubinans? <gasps> That's a, she scuffed the fucking shoe. Are you seeing this right now? Holy fuck. Oh, 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 you are dead, sister. You scuffed the Labadoons. Oh my goodness. It's okay, I don't mind. Oh no, shit. No, it's okay. Just let me know if you find the shoes and want your mom's. I will. Thanks, Olivia. I'm glad you're my uh -oh. friend. Oh, I decided to show up to the prom anyway, unprompted, unprompted, if you get what I'm saying. <laughs> and now I see that you have my shoes and we shall have a battle to the death. That's what's going to happen. That's part of this. No problem, Candace. Bye. Candy's nuts in your mouth. I don't know. I'm just saying things. I'm having fun. Yeah. Yeah. Puts. Are you fucking kidding me, bitch? Put some fucking. Have some self respect. Put some goddamn socks on. Are you kid? Are you fucking serious here? You're gonna put your bare feet in the. Bro, are you kidding me? Are you kidding? How are you gonna return the Labadoons then? Oh my goodness. My angel, you look beautiful, baby. Oh, yeah, Thanks, you yeah. look all right. Wow, nice shoes. Where'd, Where'd you, you get, get them? them? Oh, are uh, these? Uh, Candace let me borrow them. Really? Wow. Aren't those Louboutins? <laughs> oh, you know about them? Honey, I'm a fashion designer. Of course I know. Your mother's a fucking fashion designer? What the fuck? How? I feel like your mom does a, she's a fashion designer? I feel like you probably make a lot of money. But also, why would you not expect her to know what those are? I don't know, bro. The average salary for a fashion designer is $80,000 a year. I mean, holy moly. 
I mean, that's New York, so maybe that's not too much money, but not, still. You complained about how you're fucking poor? You guys do well off. You probably have a used to dad. Maybe she doesn't have a dad. I don't know. Holy moly. And Candace's mom called me a couple of weeks ago asking for advice on which ones to buy for Candace. Whoa. Oh, really? Yeah, honey. Shit. But you gave you, you couldn't put that two and two together, you fucking moron? Your kid is an idiot. You? Oh, that girl has always been so humble. Oh, shit. But I thought you were going to wear my shoes. <laughs> Those are nice. I know, Mom. I just really like these. Did you tell this to Candace? I hope you didn't make her feel bad, and that's why she let you borrow them. No, Mom. Come on. No, okay, Mom. I I'm stole sorry, them. Baby. Shut the fuck up, Mom. So, what time is Candace going to be here? Oh, I forgot to ask you to bring me. She's not going. I wonder what she's going to wear. About that, she changed her mind. A real friend would also change your mind and stay with her. Coming to prom anymore. Wait. What? Why, Why not? not? Oh, uh, I don't know. Let me call, call her. Blah, 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 blah. I guess we're. I guess I was expecting too much for this this uh, video to actually set up a, a fake prom. I was expecting that, but like obviously they're not going to even get to that part in the story. I, that was a weird. I said that weird. Olivia, is something going on? First the shoes, and now Candace isn't going to prom. And he's not. Is everything enough? okay, Olivia? Well, mom. Olivia, is everything okay? Oh, speaking of the angel. Uh oh. Here's Candace's Olivia. mom. Oh, hey. wait, mom. Wait, mom, don't, don't answer. I already answered, Susan. Hey, Susan. Hi. Wait, what? Whose name is Susan? Oh. Hey, Susan. Hi, sorry, I was just talking here to Olivia. Oh, I wanted to thank Candace. And... What? <gasps> They're missing. They're miss oh, no. She scooched them back to hopefully hide them from view. You fucking bitch. Susan, that's terrible. You stole those Flubadin shoes? I'm gonna have to a call back. I'm sorry. Um, it's just... I'm having some problems here of my own. Okay, I'll call you back. Wow, her mom's a real one. Didn't even report her. He's like, I'm having some of my own problems. I'll call you right back. Olivia? Yeah. yeah. Did you take Candace's shoes? Without asking or even telling her? What are you saying? I'm, I'm, hey, 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 Candace, I'm taking your shoes. What? No, you can't. No, I'm telling you. I'm taking the shoes. Is that what you expect this to, to happen? <laughs> oh, sweetheart, no. Why even add that line? Just be like, without asking her. That's not the type of girl I raised. Oh, well, clearly you did. That's Fucking stealing, klepto. That's baby. And from your best friend. And you know the rules. You steal something, you have to take the shoe, and you have to and put it into her eye socket. Uh, I didn't write the rules. Okay. Why would you do that? Sorry, Mom. Sorry, Mom. I just got so envious and I oh, thought Mom, you didn't understand. Oh, you didn't have to kill oh, shoes. Did, did you even think this through? I need to kill shoes, Mom. Wouldn't Candace see you wearing them if she decided to go to prom? I, I was planning to hide them. Whoa. So then if you were going to hide them, who would even see them? I don't know. My balls. A couple people, maybe some boys. Honey, this is so, so many more questions. News travels so fast in high school. Yeah. If any girl saw you wearing them, they would immediately go tell Candace. That is actually a reasonable thing to say. And I didn't expect this uh, this bit to be that intense or intelligent about that. You know what I mean? Like I tend I, I thought they would be like really shallow and like not understand that everybody would just gossip about it. And boys? Teen boys? Yeah, what about Do you think they really care that much about women's shoes? Only smelling them. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Not hers, but I'll smell her mom's shoes for fucking sure, brother. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I guess I didn't think that far ahead and I have this horrible feeling in my stomach, to be honest. Might be diarrhea. This big pimple, too. Yeah. So, did stealing them make you feel happy? No, not at all, Mom. And now I think I ruined my friendship with Candace, too. Probably, yeah. Oh, honey. You sc and and you girl. also scuffed the shoe. And now she doesn't want to go to prom. Honey. They're in the same house. They're in the same house. Look at these walls. Look at these walls. It's the same piss colored fucking house. Big pimple, too. Jesus I think I ruined my friendship with Candace, too. All right, hurry up. And now she doesn't want to go to prom. I don't want to go to prom. Honey, happiness comes from within. And these shoes. 
They're just a price tag. And friendship is a value. Yeah, okay. I hope you understand the difference, sweetie. Yeah, hey, you fucking hey, now, Mom. Olivia, Candace is a sweet and understanding girl. I'm sure you didn't lose her as a friend. I would have dropped her ass. I mean, to be honest with you, Candace is a fucking moron. Because, like, if you really think about it, Candace, literally, they were hanging out. Candace showed her the shoes. She was like, oh my god, I love these shoes. Then Candace is like, I gotta take a wee-wee. She comes out of the piss room. Olivia's gone. And so are her shoes. Who would have thought? Incredible stuff. Olivia? Olivia? Wow, surprised to see you here. I'm so surprised you to see you. Thanks, Candace. You look so beautiful, Olivia. What are you doing here? How'd you get here? It's a long drive. Well, my mother has a car, you fucking idiot, okay? Stop thinking less. Uh, just because my mom only makes $80,000 a year and isn't rich doesn't mean I can't get here. Also, it's the same house. I was in the other room. I walked outside and came back in and pretended that this was a different house. Uh, my mom drove me. Oh, does she want to come in? Actually... No, we didn't want to pay the actor. <laughs> I, uh, found your shoes. What? Whoa, wow. Where were Where they? Where did you find them? Bro, at this point, you could just lie. Candace is a fucking idiot. Candace is an absolute fucking moron. Where'd you find them? Uh, I... F driveway. They're in your driveway. I'm in your driveway. Must have misplaced them. You just didn't realize it. You fucking moron. They ended up being in my backpack somehow. Oh, what? really? How? Candace, I'm <laughs> really? How did that happen? I'm f I have a fucking traumatic brain injury. I can't process their information. Like, <laughs> what is happening? I shouldn't lie to you. I'm sorry. I took them. What? This girl's going to be manipulated in her entire life. She's incredibly gullible. She's doomed. F terrible stuff. Very sheltered. Like a prank? No, Candace. Yes. Yes, exactly. Like a silly prank. That's what I would have said. Listen, bro. You know, I know it's wrong. But now I'm gonna lie a little bit. I was, like, oh, it's just a, I was just joshing you. I was like, oh, this will be sussy. It'll really upset you. You know? It's like, I stole them when you went to the bathroom. Oh my God. Really, Olivia? Why? What, well, Olivia? I, 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 how could you? I didn't think it was you. They were gone, but I didn't understand. Jealous. I didn't know what I was thinking. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, I would have still seen you wearing them if I decided to go. I'm yeah. so sorry, Candace. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know what I was thinking. I thought it'd make me happier, but I just wanted to live your lifestyle, Franz. My lifestyle? Olivia, you don't know how hard it is to constantly get everything you want and be so sheltered that I anybody could say anything to me, and I think it's true. Sorry, Olivia. I didn't know I was showing off like that. It wasn't my intention. Oh, okay. She's actually no, not at all. You've oh. actually been really sweet to me. And you know what I want more than anything? What? For this video to end? For my best friend to come to prom and look amazing with me. Wow. <laughs> uh, but you know what, Olivia? Since you are so nice about the shoes, I'm going to let you wear them to the prom. And you can give me your busted ass shoes that came from fucking whatever, uh, Michael's. I don't know. Blooming. What's that store? Bloomingdale's? What's the store? Bushwhackers. It starts with a B. It's got a lot of bullshit there. And they have shoes as well. Bar Barnes and... No, no. Baloney. It's a it's a big but none of you know what I'm talking about. You stupid assholes. Come on, dude. Bentley. There's a word here for it. Burlington. Boom. Thank you so much. Burlington Coat Factory. That's exactly what I was thinking. Thank you so much. You guys are fucking amazing. You guys are amazing. So does that mean you'll go? Yeah, and hey, you know what? You can what? have shoes. You can wear these shoes. No, Candace. We can each wear one shoe. That's such a good idea. I'll wear a flip-flop. What are you doing here? It's fine. They won't make me any happier. You going is enough. Olivia, what did I tell you? What's mine is yours, and they're not my style anyways. Wow. Oh, you wear that's that. really, that's not very appreciative of your mother. She fucking bought you those shoes, and you're like, yeah, fuck, I don't like them anyway. You fucking bitch. Hmm, good point. I'll wear your mom's. I like antique anyways. Happiness comes from with those are your mom's antique shoes, bro. You should be wearing them from the sentimental value. Event. Your value as a person does not come from the material things in life. You always have something of value to offer the world. That's just not true. I'm telling you guys, you're probably all fucking losers. Okay, me too, but. <laughs>
<laughs> and you don't need anyone else's validation yeah. to know this. Yeah, I agree. Bro. So don't I, compare I'm yourself to your friends. Be happy for them, whatever their situation may be. Good lessons, and man. Olivia learned that day that valuing friendship yeah, is greater I love it. than any price tag. Hey, I truly hope you enjoyed yeah, today's video. Watch the if hey, you can drop it a like, drop it a like, and download the Samir Batvini app. Mean a lot to me. It only takes less I than a second, and name. it will make you feel a lot better. Definitely. Also, leave a comment. I love reading all three comments, and I try to reply to as many as I can. And subscribe to my channel. All right. He's we're growing fast and we're about to hit a million subscribers sure. and download the Samir Bhavnani app. Samir, Samir Bhavnani. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And another special shout out to all my Patreon and Twitch subs. If you'd like to support this channel further than you already have by just watching the video alone, go down to the links below where you can sub on my Patreon, which will allow you to get your name on this beautiful black wall. <laughs> uh, or you can go to the Twitch page and you can actually use a free Amazon Prime sub, if you have Amazon Prime, to subscribe. Thank you very much, guys. Take care.